A California real estate investor has put this duplex under contract for $175,000. Before you close the deal, I'm going to give you my take. This is your show. This is the show where I work for you directly, taking your needs. I'm going through the MLS, and I'm trying to find the best possible deal for you guys. Put down 25%. That's the perfect way to buy this. That's why real estate investing is the greatest industry world. Welcome to another episode of the MLS Search and Nails the Show. I'm James Wise. This is Holton Wise TV. And if you're out of state buying property in the Cleveland market, do yourself a favor and do exactly what my man JD from California has done. Order an analysis on your property before you finalize the deal, folks. A little bit of due diligence can save you thousands upon thousands of dollars, right? You'd never buy a property without a home inspection out of state, or at least you shouldn't. Well, the home inspection is going to provide you the due diligence on the inside of the property. What I'm going to do is take that into account, but also give you due diligence on the overall investment, the property's ability to generate an income for you. So if that makes sense to you, shoot my team an email, give us your phone number, we'll call you, talk to you about it. JD, this property, okay, I got some serious issues with you doing this deal. Uh, to be honest with you, brother, I got all kinds of uh, takes on this one for you, all right? Here's where we're at. 2500 Brookview Boulevard, Parma. You uh, saw this property listed by its listing agent at 178000 You have told me you have placed this thing under contract at 175000 You've got your home inspection. You sent that to me, and you've made it contingent on that home inspection as well as my analysis. Great job. You're doing all the right things, brother. Now, as far as the home inspection goes, I feel like that was like your biggest concern, the overall condition of the property. And as far as your home inspection is, it's 101 pages. Now, that's a little more than I'd like to see, right? Usually a property like this, it should probably be in like the 60 to 70 pay, uh, page range. So uh, there are some issues, but they're all relatively minor. And in my opinion, not really uh, that important to the overall analysis of your deal. One of your main questions uh, was about the asbestos tiling that they had in the basement floors. I'll tell you that's very common in these Parma homes. Okay, I see a lot of Parma homes like this with that asbestos tiling. Not the biggest deal in the world. I know folks in California, they hear the word asbestos and you guys all freak out. Look, I mean, you got to encapsulate it if it's cracking, okay? And that's just a fancy way of saying you got to cover it up, right? You could throw a vinyl allure flooring over the top of it, bada bing, bada boom. Done deal. It's not as big of a deal as you guys would think, right? So I wouldn't even really be concerned about that. That doesn't even really hit my radar uh, as far as, like, why... I have concerns with your deal here, right? What I have major concerns with is your price, brother. I, I, I think there's some serious issues with that price, right? 178 is what they have it listed. You put it on our contract at $175,000. And you did so because you ran the numbers and they looked great, right? The reason they looked great is right here, all right? Each unit, two bed, one bath, here are the rent. Eight fifty nine hundred. You go ahead and you run the numbers. It's gonna look great, right? It's gonna it's gonna look cool. It's all gonna look fine, right? What the listing agent said. Calling all investors. This is truly a turnkey property. Already income generating, and everything has been done for you. New windows painted throughout. Furnaces are about ten years old. They they last approximately thirty years. Just so you know, they cost about three G's to replace. Waterproof basement with sump pump installed. One new hot water tank. FYI, hot water tanks cost about a grand. They last about 15 years. Uh, new vinyl siding and newer roof on both house and garage. Roofs, 30 years. Probably $7,000 roof on a house like this. And beautiful hardwood floors throughout. Tenants pay all utilities, including water and sewer, and handle yard maintenance. Both tenants are under active leases with security deposits in place. Sit back and collect on this income generator offering over 11% cap rate at the current asking price. Right? So everything sounds good. The numbers sound good. As far as your inspection goes, I don't really see any major issues. But where my major issues lie is the type of duplex it is the location, and the price. And because of all that, the numbers you ran, in my opinion, are kind of irrelevant, right? Because you're drastically overpaying. I think you're overpaying by like $30,000, $40,000, right? Here's a couple factors, right? 
This property, and this is the biggest one, this is not a true duplex, bro. This is a bungalow. This is a single-family conversion, right? This isn't a real duplex. This property was a single-family home that they've hacked up and made it into two units, okay? So that's my biggest thing. If you're going to buy a duplex, you're going to spend this kind of money on a duplex, get yourself a true duplex. There is many duplexes available. So uh, if you're going to buy a smaller conversion like this, fine, but you need to get it priced less than what the true duplexes are, okay? And as far as the location, Parma's a fine community, but what you have to understand is in Parma, it borders Cleveland, right? So this is your property, this is Brook Park Road. This is the road that separates Parma and Cleveland. This is Cleveland. So this is a C-class neighborhood. This is a B-class neighborhood. If you're in Parma, the further south you go, the more expensive the properties are, okay? So we'll do a little Google Street View of the property, okay? Do-do-do. There's your property, right? There's your property. And then if you look down the street, right there, that building you see right there, that's Cleveland, okay? Okay. This is Cleveland. So you can't get any closer to Cleveland. Now, does that kill the deal? No. I mean, that in and of itself is not a deal breaker for me. The fact that it's a converted uh, single family to duplex is not a deal breaker for me, right? But when you add both of those things together and you read the comps, there's just much better deals out there for you, right? I pulled the duplex comps, duplexes that have sold in Parma last six months. Now, this one, in my opinion, is a total outlier, right? 7706 Chesterfield, right? 79 grand. I'm sure that was like totally jacked up, needed all kinds of rental. Okay, really? Why is this wall still empty? You guys should be emailing us at sales at holtonwise.com to advertise your business. But then here's what we got, right? This one, 3811 Pershing, 130. 4011 Donshire, 135, okay? These two right here, these look like single-family conversions, right? This is like what you have. Many, many years ago, they took the single-family, made it a, a duplex, not like a true built duplex. So like 130, 135. Those are applicable comps for you, right? This is a nice brick duplex, okay? That's priced at 135. That one probably had issues. These are two others, right? 136. 138 and by the way these two properties as well as these other two they're much further south than you are right so the value should be going up here's another one thornton converted duplex 138 tuxedo right 139 and when you get down here up into the high prices like where you're priced at right like that's where you start to see all these beautiful brick ones, like this one, 160, okay? And that's way further south than you are. Snow Road, 175. Snow Road again, 189. Manchester, Orchard, Thornton, Warwick, right? You see all these big, beautiful, true built brick duplexes? These are much nicer, right? And last but not least, this rent roll. I have, I have a big problem with this rent roll, bro, okay? 850 and 900 on those big beautiful brick duplexes that are much further south right rents going up a little bit much further south units are true duplex units so that's going to keep the rents higher we're not seeing price points of 850 and 900 in those right so those are better location better building and we're really only seeing $750 a month in rent. So I'm not saying the listing agent or the seller is lying to you that they actually have tenants in here at these two uh, rent rates, $850 and $900. But I'm telling you that that is not price competitive. Anybody at any time can probably get a one-off situation where you get a tenant to, to pay an above market rent rate. It could happen one-off. And I see investors, they try to base their investment on just the rental income and doing so would be a horrible mistake because as you can see you might see this and think oh this is 850 and 900 it must be worth much more than one of those brick ones further south 
uh, that's running at 750, 750, when that's not the case, right? Because going forward, you can easily replace the 750 tenants with more 750 tenants. You're probably not going to be able to replace that. And then when you go to resale, you realize you overpaid by like 40 grand, right? And when you get tenants paying above market rent, they're usually tenants that can't rent anywhere else, right? So there's probably a problem with those tenants. So sure, you could get them to sign up on a lease. Sure, you can maybe get them to pay rent a couple times, but they're probably much higher risk than your normal tenants. So your chances of evicting them are probably going to be higher, right? So for all these reasons, JD, you got to walk away from this deal, bro. If you got this thing under contract at like 130K, I would say go for it, bro. Solid deal, right? I mean, yes, it's the northern end of Parma, but it's still a B-grade neighborhood, right? It just gets much better as you go south. But again, the main thing here is you've overpaid by about $40,000, right? So there's no scenario where it makes any sense for you to overpay by 40 grand. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Holton Wise TV for more financial information, education, and entertainment.